Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. In our previous video, we made projects using MyCobot 280 Arduino, like tracking cars to record videos, picking up components and placing them on the other side very precisely, and at last, making this amazing robot dance just for fun. If you haven't watched that video yet, I recommend you to check it out after this one. I have given a link in the i button that's appearing right now on the top right of your screen. As you know, this robot cannot move beyond a 280mm radius when it's fixed. So to enhance the abilities of this robot, we are using the MyAGV Pi. This is an autonomous robot we have also covered in our previous video, which has some cool features like LiDAR, gamepad control and much more. If you haven't watched that video yet, I recommend watching both of them after this one. Now in this video, we will build a compound robot using MyAGV Pi and the MyCobot 280 Arduino from Elephant Robotics. Let's mount the MyCobot on the top of the AGV. Previously, we used this G-shaped base to mount the Arduino robot. But since we are making a compound robot, we just need these LEGO connectors. Connect these LEGO connectors on the four corners of my AGV for better safety of our MyCobot. Now attach the MyCobot 280 on the AGV facing the front direction. This is an adaptive gripper used to grab objects. Connect this to our MyCobot using the LEGO connectors. This is an extension wire for free movement of the gripper. Now let's upload the code to the Arduino board. Search Arduino in the search box. I hope you already installed it on your PC. This is the code we are uploading to the Arduino board. I modified it from the previous one, so it fits this project. To upload the code, go to Tools, select the Arduino board, then select the port, upload the code. And as you can see, our code is successfully uploaded. And we got this indication from the TX and RX lights. This is the wire that came with my AGV in accessory box. And we need to connect this to both robots so the my AGV can supply power to the my cobot Arduino. Take the robotic arm to the upright position, then turn on the power from the MyAGV and hold it until this green light glows. Now attach the Arduino Uno board to the robotic arm. I have already done the necessary setup on MyAGV to save time. Now comes the exciting part. Performing a pick and place operation. In our factory floor simulation, we have placed three objects in a row at some distance. The AGV will navigate along the path, stop at each position and the MyCobot pick up the object and place it onto the platform. This 
This is exactly how robots handle repetitive material transfer tasks in real factories. Now we will simulate the factory floor using these dark lines as a predefined path for the robot. I am keeping this box below 5000 grams to simulate the process. It can easily navigate tight corners, avoid obstacles and follow specific paths. Thanks to the laser radar and onboard camera, the mechanum wheels allow sideways and diagonal motion just like high-end industrial AGVs. If you want to buy these both robots, just open your browser and type elephantrobotics.com or click the link I have provided in the description. In the product section, select the MyCobot series. Then click on MyCobot Arduino. They have safe and secure checkout with a wide range of delivery options. I have already shown the details in the previous videos. Then click on add to cart. Now go back to the main page, select my AGV. Then click on the my AGV pie and add it to your cart as well. After that, you can proceed with the delivery and payment options. That's it for today's compound robot project. If you found this helpful, hit the like button, subscribe for more robotic content and let me know your questions in the comment section. Don't forget to check out the product links in the description and I will see you in the next one. Till then, peace out.